Okay, I'm going to try... Remember I boiled the um, porcupine quills the other day? Let's see, they're here. So I thought maybe I would strain them out of there. Maybe I could just strain this into a bowl. I know, you're looking at it thinking, of course, well, what else? But I'm not always this quick on the draw. I think I'll try and dye. I think I'll work with some of my fat quills. You can't see what's happening here, can you? Not a bit. Anyway, I'm just separating these a bit. Okay, I'll heat them up. Okay, let's take these quills, which we've already boiled in the mordant. <coughs> take these over here. Where is my sink? I think. trouble with this is that I have the fur mixed in with the quills. is just pick out the quills and separate them from the rest of it.
me the quills will float. No, they all float. These are mostly all quills. These are not the ones I just plucked out. This is what was left after the carcass decomposed. So I have the fur as well as the needles. Those are too small to use. Now, I don't think I'll throw this out on the compost because the neighbor's dog comes over and eats the compost. I think what I'll do is burn all this. This is all just at the experimental level because I've never dyed quills before. I'm just playing. <laughs> 